Okay, so if you watched my Twitter or my Instagram, you saw that recently had some damage done to my car. It was in a parking lot somewhere, and someone door dinged my rear passenger door. Well, it was only a matter of time. Right there, you can see that wonderful door ding. And you can see that there's a line that goes down from here all the way down. And so there's a hit right here, and then directly above it, right there, is where the door ding is. Oh, God. And I just noticed it today. So if anybody knows somebody in the Bay Area that can help with a, I don't know if it's a paintless dent removal or what, I'd love to get it fixed. It's just very sad day for me. It sucks and I know many of you will say enjoy your car and uh, you know, it's a car, it's meant to get, uh, you know, used and abused. But for many of us, the, our Teslas are our most expensive cars we've ever owned. Uh, Tesla is essentially a stretch car. That means if you have a budget of 35K, you can get a Tesla for 5K more. You're gonna stretch your budget to afford that Tesla. And so some of us want to keep it in pristine condition. I am one of those people, no disrespect for those of you who don't PPF their cars or ride naked, I give you credit. You have a lot of guts. In any case, uh, I, just it's really bothering me. So I thought, why not get it fixed? And what does it take to get it fixed? So we're gonna take a look at that today. Okay, so if you didn't already know, I live in the Bay Area, very close to the Fremont Tesla factory. It's on the East Bay of the Bay Area. And there's a lot of different options out here. Today I've come to BMW Service Center in Concord. It's about 40 minutes away from home. Uh, why BMW? Well, this BMW is certified Tesla Repair Center. So they can do paint and body work and so forth. Now, I'm not doing any paint or body work uh, on my car. I think mine is a very simple fix, which can be done using a paintless dent removal. Now, there's a lot of people who do paintless dent removal, but I trusted uh, Concord BMW because they are Tesla certified. So I figure the contractors that they work with are gonna be great contractors as well. So let's go inside and figure out what needs to be done and more about this. Okay, so we're inside and we're here with uh, Kevin Miller. Uh, Kevin, you're the kind of the director here of uh, collision and repairs here at yeah. Weatherford BMW. Yeah, so we've got three shops, uh, two shops, uh, one in Oakland, one in Berkeley, and the one here in Concord. Um, the two over uh, Oakland and, and Berkeley are Weatherford BMW shops, and uh, here we're BMW Concord. Um, we do uh, BMW, Audi, and Tesla. Nice. So what was involved in kind of getting Tesla certified? Because not everyone is a Tesla certified body shop, right? Right. So they, they, they look at your financial statements. They want to make sure you're a, uh, a financially stable shop. Um, there's about a $70,000 tool investment. Um, and then there's a, uh, um, about 20 to 30 hours of training for each individual technician to go through um, to uh, actually get that certification level. Nice, and I can see plenty of Teslas. In fact, I'm in front of one that you can't tell is a Tesla, but it is. Frightening, but that is. What are we working on on this one? Uh, basically, uh, a fairly light front end, front end damage, uh, but we need to, uh, to fi put fixtures in to check it to make sure you, all your, your suspension points, your uh, front frame rails are all in the uh, proper positions, which this one actually is. How many Teslas do you guys get in here? Oh, I've probably got probably close to 20 in here right now. Um, so we've, we've been Tesla certified for about two months now. So we're just kind of kind of ramping up. Nice, nice. But I, I anticipate it to be a, uh, uh, quite a few per month. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and remind me again, how long did it take to get Tesla authorized? Um, it took us the, from start to finish uh, we were pretty aggressive with it. We bought the equipment right away. Um, it was about a three-month process. So, 
So just so that's very clear, it's not easy to be Tesla authorized, it requires a lot of work, but you know, we're grateful for places uh, like Weatherford BMW uh, that are giving us as owners more options of places to go to in case something small like my dent or something big like some of these other vehicles that are in here, uh, options to go to. Another larger repair with the uh, battery to allow these to plug uh. into, the, into the chassis. Well, thank God the battery's okay on this yeah. vehicle that went off-roading. Very cool. But these are part of the proprietary tools that need to be bought. The, the What do they call it? The battery... It's a battery lifting table. Battery lifting and a, table. Uh, and a uh, front cradle carrier. So that allows you to bring it all down in one piece. Correct. I think you've got more than enough space. So how many total cars can you store? I can probably have almost 140 cars in here at one time. Jeez. Well, hopefully it never is that many. We're also uh, in the process of becoming a um, Subaru certified. This is where all the parts, so like Tesla parts, BMW parts, everything comes okay. into here. And so this is where all paint uh, gets done whether it doesn't matter what car it is. Doesn't matter what car it is. We have double wide so we can do a car and all the parts at once, or a Go lot ahead. of parts. Just depends on what's going through that particular time. Yeah. And then we can see. Now, is something is paint being done here going to be of a different, better quality than paint coming out of Tesla? Be Ooh. honest. <laughs> We it's, all know. Uh, oh yeah. You, you put me on the spot. Um, no, no worries. Yeah, me. it's uh, it's different. I mean, yeah. they're they're pumping a lot of cars through. Yeah. Um, we're doing one at a time. We correct any mistakes that happen right away before the customer gets them. Yeah. Um, Tesla doesn't have hasn't had that luxury yet. Yeah. They're getting there. Yeah, definitely. Um, the the build has gotten a lot better. Actually, you can see over here. This is, uh, So uh, now Weatherford does do service and body and paint, but in my car, uh, I didn't need all of that. I needed something simple and easy. So they actually contract out the paintless dent removal, right? Exactly. And that's where you come in? Yeah, my name's Rick and I do all the dents for Kevin. Yeah. All right. Well, Rick, what, what needed to be done on my car? And uh, uh, there was a, a little door ding on this body line here. We just got it out for you. You know, about maybe a 10, 15 minute wait. Knock it out for you really fairly, fast. Fairly easy. Oh yeah, the, the results speak for themselves. There was a dent right here, and it looks brand new again. Oh yeah, you can't see it at no, all. No, you can't see it at all. Oh my God. Yeah, you're all set. And so, for people who have door dings, right? This happens, and I was explaining to the users, a lot of people say, listen, just drive the car, enjoy the car. But for many, this car is a, is a stretch. They stretch their money, they stretch their budget to right. afford a Tesla. And so for a lot of people, this is the most expensive car they've ever owned. Uh, and so for some of us, a little dent like that hurts and it hurts us inside to see it. And so having an option like this, now, now I came over here, but this is something that you guys do mobily as well. Uh, yeah, we prefer to have it done here at the shop though. Okay, Same okay. for the customer. Yeah, 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 exactly. And it doesn't take long at all. Yeah, and so just for kind of the viewers who want to look into a service like this, whether they be local, they can come and check out Weatherford uh, here in, in Concord, or you have three locations, three, right? Three, yeah. Okay. yeah, we, we consider this Concord, so BMW Concord. Okay. Um, the other two, Weatherford on West Grand and Weatherford on East Shore in Berkeley, right at the Gilman exit. Okay. And uh, anyone who is getting a paintless dent removal, what can they expect on average to, I know you can't speak for other companies, but what does something like this usually kind of cost? Uh, r roughly around 100 to 200 bucks. Okay. Some, something fairly uh, easy for the customer, you know? Nothing, yeah. Nothing very pricey or nothing. Exactly. So a hundred depends on the dent as well. Yeah, right, of course. Sure. Uh, now let's talk about like a, a, a nice corner dent where, you know, it's in there pretty big. It's probably the size of your fist. 
Uh, what would something like that be? Probably around two to three hundred. Okay. Something like so that. So still not bad. Two to three hundred dollars, and your dent is removed. You feel better about your car. It still looks good. And I, I mean, I'm gonna really look at this, but just off the bat, I can't see anything. That is really, really impressive. Thank you guys so yeah, and much. Yeah, you save your OEM paint and everything. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, no no need to repaint or anything. We took a look at a red one that was right. being fully repainted, so uh, saves on the money as well. You got it. Cool. Thank you so much, Rick. Yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah, if you ever need to get a hold of me, get a hold of Kevin, and I'm, you know, always here too. Yeah, yeah. Right on, Rick. Yeah, you got it, buddy. Thanks, man. Yeah. You got the key to start it because I can't start it again. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> Weatherford yeah. BMW. Uh, look them up. They they do some great work here. As you can see, tons of Teslas uh, in the shop. They are Tesla authorized. They've got amazing paintless dent removal uh, guys who will come here and do the job for you. I can attest to it. I see it with my own eyes. Um, cheap, easy, and quick. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right. So I want to thank Kevin and Rick for taking care of my car today. It just was absolutely incredible. And the work is, I mean, I just can't stop staring at it. It was such good work. If you're looking for any body paint uh, damage from something small like dents or to major collision repair, uh, check out Weatherford BMW here in Concord. Uh, they've got a couple locations as well. And uh, they do great work. In fact, Kevin took me for a tour outside of the facility uh, after the repair was done and just showed me how much work is actually involved in being a certified Tesla uh, center. And it's a lot. They had things from calibration cards for the autopilot cameras, to uh, geofencing for the service center, to know when cars are outside and inside. And there's just a lot involved and I really appreciate the work that they did. And glad that McFly is back in perfect condition. If you're new to this channel, uh, consider subscribing. Go ahead and hit this video with a thumbs up if you liked it and uh, Remember, amazing. Remember to fuel on electricity, and I'll catch you guys next time.